we're back with another episode of the OG Admirals. Now, last night, we did take a tough loss against the Minnesota Wild in overtime, and here is that goal. We're going to get ourselves a hero tonight, or what? It's overtime, and the clock is ticking. Yes! Yes! They win! They win in overtime! And the silly game is struck tonight! I have no words. with some great speed to break away from the pack. And then it's all about the execution when you're one-on-one -on -one with the goaltender. What was that guy doing? To your practice days and you use your but obviously, you can't see it up on Twitch, but you can see it up on YouTube as you can click on the link below to my YouTube channel, youtube.com slash Alan But tonight, we are facing the toughest team in the league right now is the Tampa Bay Lightning. They have a good coach, Coach Cooper. John Cooper, that is. He's been terrific all year long. But can we fight it out with the victory in the standings? We're still in first with the 32-2-1. Like I said, we took a tough loss in overtime last night. Skip, he couldn't handle it in overtime, so that's why Dustin is getting a start tonight against the Lightning with their record being 24, 8, and 6. So they're going to try to come at us early, but we can, should be able to win tonight. We'll have to wait and see. But tonight, I'm introducing the starting lineup for tonight's match between the Tampa Bay Lightning and the Fight Bears. He is your captain, wearing number 24, Allen, at left wing. Wearing number 89, Corey Conacher, at right wing. Wearing number 34, Devontae Smith, Pelly. At left defense, wearing number 55, Kurt Seifer, at right defense. Wearing number 88, Kyle Seifer. Interested in the second line for tonight. It's a matchup between the Lightning. At center, wearing number 25, Tyler Johnson, at left wing. Wearing number 20, he is Cedric Labrie, at right wing. Wearing number 7, DeMarco Hario, at left defense. Wearing number 10, Mike Angelita! At right defense. Wearing number 8, Team Andre Pilat. Interesting, the third line for tonight's matchup between the Lightning at center. Wearing number 23, Charles Smith. At left wing. Wearing number 17, Alex Killorn. At right wing. Wearing number 29, Eric Nielsen. At left defense. Wearing number 72, DJ King. At right defense. Wearing number 26, Josh McDougal. And he's in the fourth line for tonight's matchup between the Lightning at center. Wearing number 44, Badier Mahalik at left wing. Wearing number 18, Andre Pollock. And at right wing, wearing number 12, Danny Cadet. And starting between the pipes tonight, he's got the green light to go ahead and get this job done, hopefully. Wearing number 32, Dustin Tukarski. That's your starting lineup for tonight's matchup between the Tampa Bay Lightning. Can the dogs pick up a victory after a tough loss last night in overtime? They just have to shake it up and change it up and see what they can do tonight. We're going to be rocking the red jerseys tonight as the Lightning will be rocking the OG blue home jerseys. Tell them apart from us. So let's see if we can't pull out the victory here in Norfolk. Lightning. Dogs. Up next. Well, you guys are having an amazing weekend. Whenever you guys are watching this, uh, of course, make sure you drop that like, hit that subscribe button if you are new. Get back to watching and enjoy episode 36. Welcome to that sexy stadium that your boy made as we feature an Eastern Conference versus Western Conference match. Who is and ready for a Sunday night hockey? The Bolts have won the draw and we are now underway. And now it's over to point. Read it perfectly and breaks up the play. Smith Pelly's got it across the line. Woo! Takes a knock, but he still got the puck. And he takes 
I said on their stick and to get to scoring areas to not hit the net. Even if they don't score, they'll get a rebound if they at least hit the Why did you ice it? Sends it ahead to Smith Curry. And he can't hang on after that hit. Moves it to the middle. And that's stopped. North folks gain possession along the boards. Oh, Allen's got way. the puck from the back end. Oh and my that god. Nullifies that threat for the moment. Tukarski's got the puck and he's gonna Why? Hit. Why and Dustin ice it right there? That's nothing. Hedman's a great defender who can disrupt the opposition and she even has his teammates she generate bad. chances from Ooh, the back then. end. She move? LeBree's she big move. rig zone ability She's is look, when he not, drives the uh, puck to the shit. crease while shielding it with his body. Let's see if one of these players can give their team the edge tonight. I know I'll be watching. Guys, back to you. Puck picked up by Yaros. Oh, getting a piece of that one. Vasilevsky's in such great position. He's able to redirect that puck to safety right to the corner. Quick shot. It's a save. Sorelli sticking it in his own zone. Paul's got the puck. The dogs have it from their own end. Gains the zone through the middle. Into the middle. Quickly over to Kalor. Referee's hand shoots high in the air. It looks like we got a tripping penalty coming up. And the play is so dead. Dogs, I had to find. Once the stick in the cages, the you know it's going to be a tripping call. One more time. Your dogs are here to the price. Power play. One more time. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. And that doesn't reach the net. Slides it back to the blue line. Oh, he kind of struggled with that one, but he got just enough to keep it out. Look at this attack. on a power play. Find number 18, Andre. precision, And you have to create some motion to open up lanes. That's exactly what happens here. They're able to get the puck to the middle of the ice, and that's how they get the goal. Norfolk's gone in front by one here in the back half go, of the first. Go, and how does this change the, the complexity of the game? Well, it's a lot better being ahead than it is being behind Andre James, and they're ahead now, so they've got the goal. Assisted by number 7, DeMarco Hyde, and assisted by number 44, Vladir Mahalik. To get the matchups that they want. Listen, their opponent is vulnerable these next two shifts. They need to respond accordingly. So dangerous tonight, James. He scored the goal ahead goal, and he's got the puck on his stick now. Handles it along the blue line. And now it's grabbed by Stamkos. Back tracks with the puck to maintains possession. Hickman's got it in the defensive end. And now he moves it quickly to Hurdle. Poked away at center by Conacher. Picked up along the wall by Hagel. And they'll battle for that loose puck along the boards. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Smith Pelly's taking it from his own end. The Bolts have it in the offensive zone. A loose shot! North Bolts grab the hold of the puck. And the play continues. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. Headman pass. Quick pass to Headman. Oh, it's a buzzer! It's the post! Ending period number one, but this one is far from over. Lots more action to go. Second period it is just around the It ain't over until the fat lady sings. At the end of one, to face zeros, Norfolk one. The dogs putting on the puck in the back of the net. The early power play goal by Andre Pilat. Can that be the game winner? You'll just have to wait and find out for yourselves in the second period.
The last second, 0 0.8 seconds on the clock. Tampa Bay with that hit the post shot. Almost went in. That would have been the end of it for Tukarski. But Dogs putting on the battle after a tough loss last night. Can they turn it around tonight? With fresh legs in the pipes tonight. Tukarski doing his thing. Shot through the heart. It looks too much. Oh, to me, you know. Bad man, bad man. Bad man, bad man. Second to me, this underway as the puck is dropped. Well, Cheryl, over to the third of this one play. What do you make of this one? The Bullets need to find their legs, James. There's no urgency, and they really haven't been skating at all. They've been chasing the game. They've had zero possession time. they got to find a way to carry the puck and get some opportunities. Fires it on net. What a save by Vasilevsky. Takes the pass. Here's a pass. Oh! And that's to oh! Hertz is really showing his nose for the net and his tenacity around the puck. He stumbles and he's off balance. Listen, the puck is not in the perfect position to shoot, but he manages to corral it and still get it to the net. These are the types of efforts it takes to win big games. Oh! oh the second goal of the game! Goals, 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 goals! Second of the game. Was hoping that it's 14 of the season. Why not 18? I'm great. Oh, wow! Yes, the friendly paying on the post. Taking a two-nothing lead here in the second. Been a real dominant performance tonight. Oh, goals, 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 goals! Second of the game. It's 14 of the season. By number 18, Andre Pilat. Assisted by number 34, the Bartos Spiffelli, and assisted by number 10, Mike Angelina. That's when that goal, goal, scored, scored. It's second of the game. It's 14 Thunder season, by number 18, Andre Pilat, assisted by number 34, Devonta Shifeli, and assisted by number 10, Mike Angelina. And they win the offensive zone face-off, and here we go. Tampa Bay is going to hold it along the wall. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Tukarski. How many times have we seen this save before from him, James? I mean, he loves the butterfly position. He's real mobile in his crease. Oh, Andre said he wants what the hat. The whistle as the puck's covered up. Palat's playing with such confidence right now, and he's got this point streak going. And when that's happening for you, you're having a ton of fun putting up the points. Talking to you, let's say, hey, hands up, the play my song. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Norfolk's got possession of the puck. Angles it over to Palat. And that's poked away in the offensive zone by Yaros. And we'll get a breather here with offside the call. I came in like a wrecking ball. Looks like lineups are set. No, I got to get things back on the Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Sorelli's won the draw at center. Scooped up along the wall by DeHaan. Keeps a hold of it on the play. The Bolts are on the attack. That knocks it off the puck. Angelinas plays it now. Make a change. Moves the puck along the half wall. Battle along the wall. Oh, just a great heads up play by Chano. Palazzo's a true sniper, James, and he's already got two in the game, and you know he's looking for his third. He's got two goals already. Puck's on his stick. He's hunting his third. Takes that pass back at the point. To the low side. Keep the pressure on. From the left side, takes it at center. Centering pass. Oh, and they can't connect on the pass because it was broken up in front. Hammers it on net. Huge stop by Vasilevsky. Quick pass to Kyle. And he takes the feed. Off course off a of body. Quick 
shot denied by the goaltender. Now the name of his game is Speed James, and he can move at the same speed with the puck as he does without it. It's one of his factors of his game that is so difficult to defend. And at the end of two, Jeff Van Zero, Norfolk two. The players, ice. We're back with a third period next. The dogs put on a show for their home fans after a tough loss against the Wild last episode and last night with a tough overtime loss. If you want to go check that episode out, I'll leave a video in the corner. You can go check it out. Show that video some love. Also, go show some love for my vlog. Just came back from Baltimore last t Sunday. Go check that out. You guys are killing it with that video as well. I appreciate every, every single one of you for reviewing it. If you are new, make sure you hit that subscribe button as we return to the third period with a 2 nothing lead here in Norfolk. Ice cream and cake and cake. Ice cream and cake and cake. That's slip, slip, slip and slide. Slip, slip, slip and slide. Two-thirds of the way to the finish line in this one for regulation time. Cheryl, how do you view it? Tampa Bay's got to find a way to get some more shot volume in this third period, James. They really haven't had much for the first 40 minutes of play. But they'll also need to be quality as the third period winds down because you don't get many opportunities. And when you do, you got to have them from high-danger scoring areas. And then you got to capitalize. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Hammers it! Woo! Attacking in. Takes it to the net. Oh, what? what a save on the play. And there's nothing to How is that interfering? That is bro. all about the will to find a way to make that save incredible, James. Our dogs are headed to a prime penalty kill. What more time? Oh, give me a break. He just fell down. This power play is ranked top 10 in the league, guys. Your they are dogs are here to prime penalty kill. The first one of the night. Let's see what happens. Oh, a quick little pickpocket on the play. Tukarski's last save was absolutely incredible, James. Not only was it pure desperation and athleticism, but I'm not sure how he can stretch that far. I'm trying to shake loose. All alone. Can't get that one to go. That's extremely frustrating when you do the work to get in on a breakaway and then you get nothing in return, a missed opportunity. Along the half wall with the puck. Quick shot. Denies him! Vasilevsky's able to deny that scoring chance right from the slot area, James. That's a beautiful one. Here's a shot. Got the puck up there with the chance. Say, hey, oh. Uh, 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 uh. Say, hey, oh. Get ready for the face off. Carry on my way. Tampa Bay's got it and they're on the attack. Oh, tremendous reflexes with the kick save. Good fight for the puck along the boards. Picked up along the boards by Palat. Oh, what a hit along the wall. And that's a clean one, James. A great angle, shoulder to shoulder, and just laid it on thick. Receives the pass. Norfolk's got it in their own zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. And a successful clearing attempt. Pyle standing up, ready to go. And he coughs it up with the pass. Norfolk's got it in their own zone. Pyle's back out onto the ice as we are back to even strength here. James, I remember protecting a lead at How in the, the hell? winner games and having to find a way to, to get that puck out. And, how critical it was to have good habits, be strong on the puck, and play physical. This group did a great job. A quick stop by Tukarski. When the puck's in the low slot, the goaltender gets right out next to the shooter and makes the save. I have not we ever haven't even got hit the midway mark of the period. And it's a two-nothing hockey game. Tampa Bay's won the draw inside the offensive zone. Now let's see what they can do with it. Can't stay on his feet after that hit. 
Puts the feet in front. Oh, and they couldn't complete that. The Bulls have it now. Into the offensive zone. Oh, he'll feel that one. Quick feed to Conacher. He carries the puck up along the wing. Here's a shot. Oh, an unbelievable stop by Vasilevsky. Smith-Pelly's got it against the boards. Here's a shot. Woo, DJ said he was far in the action tonight. And it's stopped by the club. Nice play there. San Jose's up next on the schedule. Tickets still available. Go to the box office or you can get them online. I woke up in a new Bugatti. Oh. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Looks to make a play over to Sergeyev. Takes it across the blue line. Norfolk's got the puck in the defensive end. Gets it over to Lorraine. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Cuts to the point. Stopped by the goaltender. Vasilevsky's been under siege all game long. I mean, his defense is doing nothing to protect him, but one save after another. They're lucky that they're still in Beautiful this game. Beautiful hit by DeMarco Hargrove. Oh, yeah. Up on the other side of the board. Who had the edge? Carl and standing by with if the answer. If I die young, bury me in this game, guys. Me Neither player we talked about earlier has been able to get on the board, but despite that, I think he's been engaged and worked hard out there. And he'll take a moment to regroup back at center. Norfolk's got a hold of the puck. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Moves it around along the half wall. Puck scooped up by Labrie. He takes a moment to backtrack, but maintains possession. One Lock minute remaining! Into the attacking area from the left side. Oh, he's going to get cold on that slash. Your dogs are headed to the prime! Now, we all know the result of this game, Jams, even the buzzer you take a penalty, now you can't get your goaltender out. One more time! Number of factors that led to this loss. Your dogs are headed to the prime! Power play! One more time! I love this. I coach this with my team because I love the bumper spot and I love the net front player. You're taking away the eyes of the goaltender, but he can also pop out below the goal line and present as an option. So multiple variations that can strike. And as the final seconds tick off the clock... Go! Empty netter sends the fans to the exit! Dustin. Fist bumping everywhere, even when it was the empty net. Oh, I love that the power play. And on the empty netter is test of the season. Final 23, Trevor Smith. Unassisted. And that's a smart heads up play by Smith Pelly. Norfolk's been stifling their opponent. And that will do it. Shut up. Austin! Puts the dogs back in the win column. Once again, that goal goes scored on the power play in the empty nerder by North 23. Trevor Smith. That you see between the fan base and their team, and it's a tradition, right? You come out on the ice and you want to salute them and say thank you for providing energy throughout the game. Final Final score here tonight's in Norfolk. Denver Bay zero. Norfolk three. And now she's in the three stars for tonight's matchup. First, first star from your Norfolk Dog. Who got the empty nether number 23? Trevor Smith. First star from your Norfolk Dog. Way up 34, Devontae Smith Kelly. And the number one star, we got the two goals tonight, a power play goal and an even strength goal, number 18, Andre Pollock. It's the three stars for the next matchup between the two Bay Lightning. First, the third star from your Norfolk Dogs. Number 23, Trevor Smith. Second star from your Norfolk Dogs. Number 34, Devontae Smith-Pelly. And the number one star from your Norfolk Dogs, 
We're in number 18. We've got two goals, one power play goal, and the even strength goal. Number 18, Andre Pallant. Once again, the final score here in Norfolk. Norfolk bounces back after a tough loss against the Wild, but beats Tampa Bay tonight 3 to nothing. Until then, guys, I hope to see you in the next one. Hope you have a nice day, and peace out.